Hey everyone, welcome back to That's So Real Estate. This is Natalie with the Safe Harbor team. All right, so I've seen on these Facebook groups in the last couple of days that a lot of people are freaking out about lost leads and missing phone numbers. So I wanted to show you how you can go into Facebook and find them. I know a lot of people are saying that because these ads are run out of KW API, it's not possible to find them on Facebook. However, I'm telling you right now that's not true, and I will show you how to find them. So here you'll see the last campaign that we, that we ran. Um, it was a two-day campaign from Friday to Sunday. Technically ended like last night at 12 a.m. So you'll see here it says that we have 26 leads. However, every time we end a campaign, I make sure to go back to Facebook and make sure that we're not missing anything. We also noticed this morning that we were missing phone numbers from half of our leads. However, um, our director of operations, Liz, who also runs this account, um, she went back and put all of the numbers in. So now it looks like they're complete because she did it manually. So, yeah. Anyway, so go into Facebook and then you can open up the business page or whatever page you ran your ad through and you'll go up here to publishing tools. Once this opens up, you will look at the left-hand sidebar. Loading. Okay. So over here, you will notice it says Lead Ads Forms. Click on that. And you will find all of your ads right here. So here you can see 27. Again, I'll go back. It only brought 26 through. So if you go over here and you click Download, Make sure you select download by date range, especially if the campaign is already over. Lifetime, that's good. Download. Now you can select a CSV version and a spreadsheet will download. So here you will find all of the phone numbers complete and all of your leads. So here are 27, just because the first line is just the title. All right. Oh, someone's actually asking how to do this while I'm making the video. <laughs> All right. So that being said, I'm going to go back here and show you something else that happened. Um, so this is the video that I first posted that was like 28 cents per lead um, showing you how to make a listing ad. So here you'll see it says 96 and it says 31 cents. So obviously, since this campaign ended, leads have been pulled out of command. Um, Liz thinks that this is because command is getting rid of all the duplicate leads, meaning like if someone had submitted their information on this ad and then also clicked on this ad, they'll get rid of it from this one because it's already in here. Um, that being said, I'm not positive on this. Uh, that's just our theory at the moment. So either way, I would still go back into here and check. So see it here, it says 107. Again. Download, download by date range, download, CSV, open it up, and here are all of your leads. So yeah, it really is as simple as that. Um, on this campaign right here, so this is actually basically the same ad as that one I made the video for. I'll just show you the little differences. Um, so this one was a still photo of the exterior, which is what I typically do. Emojis back when they were working. So yeah, I basically took the same ad copy. I just changed this here um, to say like completely renovated ranch or something like that. So notice here that this was made between Christmas and New Year's. So you're not always going to get that many leads um, or that great of a result. You know, it depends on the day of the week you post, what time of the year. Christmas to New Year's, everyone's home, they're on Facebook, so that's probably why it was about 10 cents better than the last one I did, which was almost identical. Um, there are a few differences here that you'll notice. It's the same property, um, no emojis, there we go, I took out the emojis, and I did an animated uh, social post from Canva. I'll show you how to do this in another video probably later this week. So, 
Yeah. That being said, 27 leads for $10 is really not bad at all. I'll take that any day. Um, yeah, so I'm going to try to keep... I know a lot of you guys watching this are in my KW Command Facebook lead mastermind group. Um, I'm going to try to keep that group mostly Facebook ads related and lead follow-up and everything like that. So we will be posting more general command videos however they'll only be on our youtube channel so please subscribe and oh one last thing if you are a part of keller williams greater cleveland um liz our director of operations who is also an admin on this account and runs this youtube account with me um we will be speaking in place of the sales meeting tomorrow at 9 30 in the rocky river office in the training room um we will be going over everything having to do with Facebook ads. So best practices, what interests we use, all of our settings. I will actually walk you through step by step how to create these ads, um, the ones that have been doing really well, and just answering any questions you might have. And Liz will be showing you how to create a landing page for your ads too. So if you can stop by, it'll be really educational. I think a lot of people can get some value out of it. Um, yeah, so that's all for today. If you have any questions, please leave it in the comments. I'm happy to help in whatever way I can. All right. Thanks, guys.